Today we're at Snakes and Ladders helping Glen Rock Trail Alliance and National Parks with maintaining the trails. We're just putting some extra soil in to prevent erosion as we like to minimise the footprint of the event of course and make sure that the trails are in great condition for everyone to ride. With Port to Port we're really lucky to have a course team that's really passionate and they work 12 months of the year on Port to Port because it's basically their playground and it's what they love to do. So we're really thrilled that they're on board year after year for all of the riders to enjoy the trails. We work towards improving the trails and the access that riders have in the Newcastle area and it's a fantastic way of being involved with the community by coming out on a build day like today. We're running a sausage sizzle and uh, providing drinks for the guys just to help keep them fueled up and as you might be able to see in the background, um, they're moving a fair bit of dirt today. So the build days are a really great opportunity for volunteers and riders to get up close and personal with the rangers. They're out there on the tools and they get an opportunity to learn and also put the effort into the trails that they'll get to enjoy later on. Port to Port work very closely with national parks, not just when the event's on, but throughout the year. Right from when the last rider crosses the line this year, we'll be starting to talk with them about what we're planning to do next year. It's about knowing where those trails are allowed to be. It's not that you can just go and put a trail anywhere. We need the advice of these guys because they're experts and they're the ones that are gonna maintain it year in and year out and only get the park better. A huge thanks goes out to all the volunteers, the crew, the staff, and everyone involved in making the trails great. A massive thanks goes out to National Parks for letting us into their beautiful place.